All right, what's going on, guys? Trev back again here to bring you another video. This one's going to be doing our final review for the first season of X Men '97. This one for the finale episode, Tolerance is Extinction, Part Three. All right, dudes, and spoiler warning: if you have not seen the final episode yet for X Men '97, that's episode ten. Uh, for, uh, yeah, uh, first season, hopefully we'll get to see a season two or an X-Men 98, uh, whatever name and convention they use. I feel like this one has hit really hard in terms of, you know, fans of the 90s, X-Men the Animated Series, finally getting to see, um, you know, a continuation of that, and they did an absolutely marvelous, uh, job on the first season for x-men 97 the finale episode part three was an extended i think it was like a double almost two episodes and one almost for episode 10 and uh, we got to see kind of the finale with bastion the finale with magneto um you know what was happening with that wolverine and everything that was left off with with wolverine having the adamantium ripped off and Magneto being, uh, you know, uh, almost dying, Professor X intervening, kind of uh, forcing him to, um, you know, restore all of the uh, power on Earth. And then we see uh, the humans strike uh, Asteroid M, sending it into a tizzy and, and going to be crashing down into the, uh, the Earth um which uh and, and missiles not working to to stop it on the way um and so so you've got kind of a, a really packed finale episode here with episode 10 a lot of different things happening some awesome fight was sequences between you know rogue and bastion uh cyclops and bastion um some some heartfelt scenes with um you know cyclops and gene and a uh, cable uh, pretty cool fight scene where bastion rips cables futuristic uh cybernetic uh, arm off and somehow absorbs it uh into his own form to create kind of like a version of bastion that i've seen in some of the comic books where he almost looks like archangel mixed with bastion or something like this he gets kind of like these um, these uh these wings and stuff really awesome becomes like a super super sentinel let's say like the uh, maybe the most powerful sentinel ever and um just all kinds of awesomeness then we get to finish off with the episode 10 with a to be continued and you've got part of the x-men that are way in the past in apocalypse's timeline maybe when apocalypse's you know was first uh you know was was kind of first getting started uh, before he's got kind of the full-on blue and everything and then you've got some of the x-men that are in the future uh with possibly a future version of cable that's not fully grown up yet something like this um all kinds of awesome stuff going on in this finale episode i have to give it a 10 um, this was a great way to finish off the first season for X-Men. Everybody got to get their stuff in. You had, you know, Magneto, Professor X. There was a prediction we might see Onslaught. So maybe they'll do that in, in season two if they do a season two. Um, you know, Cable's awesome in it. Mr. Sinister's awesome in it. Bastion's unbelievable in it. Really, really awesome. Um, yeah, everybody. It's just an incredible uh, addition to X-Men the Animated Series is very true to what X-Men the Animated Series was and it just kind of continues um, you know gives you a full another 10 episode season of everything that X-Men the Animated Series did best with some new storylines for the comics that haven't been adapted yet and an awesome setup for what could be a great season um, season two you get to see lots of cool cameos in this episode again uh peter parker mary jane the animated series version daredevil captain america iron man um modular iron man and and kind of omega red all kinds of uh really cool cameos cloak and dagger are even in it so all kinds of awesome stuff so it's a perfect finish to to an amazing season so i'll be shocked if x-men 97 doesn't get renewed for a season two um you know there's got to still be some x-men fans from the 90s that are still out there and you know anybody who is a fan of x-men this is like the best animated series i've seen probably since the 90s 
Uh, it's been a while since we've had like a really good, you know, uh, uh, cartoon series. Anime has got some awesome stuff. There's been some awesome anime series, Dragon Ball Super and Naruto and others, One Piece, Bleach, and you know, Attack on Titan and lots of others. But we haven't had like a really good cartoon series in a long time. Invincible's been pretty good. Some of the others, you know, that have been out, uh, TMNT 2003 was pretty damn good in the 2000s. But since like the 90s, we haven't had one that's probably this good, I wouldn't say. So let me know what you guys thought about the first season of X-Men 97. They killed it. They did an amazing job. They did. Uh, they honored the first series and, you know, the, the 90s X-Men and just brought it forward. They did an incredible job. So before you leave, if you don't mind, thumb the video up, leave a comment below, and I'll see you guys again soon for another review. As always, it's Travis saying peace. Later, guys. See you soon.